Hey there, YouTube fam. Today I've got an incredible story to share with you, straight from the picturesque landscapes of Norway. Get ready for an amazing tale that will warm your heart and leave you in awe. So let's jump right into it. Our story revolves around Ella, a spunky elderly woman in her 70s, living in a cozy little house on the outskirts of town. Despite her age, Ella had an adventurous spirit and loved taking long walks every day, surrounded by the breathtaking beauty of Norway's nature. She had explored those nearby forests countless times and had never encountered any unusual incidents. But one fateful day, something extraordinary happened that changed her life. Picture this, Ella was strolling through the forest, as she often did when suddenly she heard a loud, unmistakable gunshot. It echoed through the trees, sending a shiver down her spine. Curious and concerned, she scanned her surroundings trying to locate the source of the sound. No hunter was in sight, but she knew they must be out there, tracking down the majestic deer that roamed the area freely. With her heart pounding, Ella continued her walk, undeterred by the unnerving experience. However, just a few steps further, she stumbled upon a truly alarming sight. Right there in the middle of the path lay a wounded deer. The poor creature had been shot and had fled, but exhaustion had overtaken it, forcing it to collapse right before Ella's eyes. Concern flooded Ella's heart as she approached the injured animal. Now, here's where our brave and compassionate protagonist comes into play. Ella, without any professional training, decided to lend a helping hand to the struggling deer. Despite its relatively small size, she gathered all her strength and managed to transport the wounded creature back to her house. It was a Herculean effort, but she knew she had to do whatever she could to save this beautiful animal. With determination in her eyes, Ella carefully placed the deer on her porch and hurried to fetch food and water. She set a bowl next to the deer's head, hoping to revive its strength. However, the poor thing showed little interest in eating. Undeterred, Ella examined the wound, treating it with disinfectant and skillfully bandaging it using whatever cloths and bandages she could find around the house. She even managed to administer some painkillers, unsure if they would even work on an animal. With a warm blanket covering the young deer, Ella could only hope for the best and wait. That night, as she lay in bed, her hopes were dim. Little did she know that a heartwarming surprise awaited her the next morning. When she woke up and ventured outside, she found the deer not only alive, but also looking at her with renewed vigor. The food and water bowl were empty, indicating that the deer had indeed nourished itself. Ella was ecstatic and rushed to replenish the supplies. In the following days, the deer's strength gradually returned, much to Ella's delight. The wound, luckily, wasn't as severe as initially feared, and the animal was fortunate enough to avoid infection. Ella diligently changed the bandages and kept the wound clean. As time passed, the wound started healing, forming a protective scab. The deer grew stronger each passing day, and a remarkable bond of friendship developed between Ella and her newfound companion. You won't believe this. But one fine morning, Ella woke up to find the deer had ventured beyond her porch and into her garden. It was a truly magical sight. Despite a slight limp due to the wound on its front legs, the deer hobbled happily towards Ella as she stepped out of her door. She lovingly fed him some bread and placed fresh water before him. It was a heartwarming moment, symbolizing the triumph of compassion and care. Months went by, and the deer became a regular visitor near Ella's house. With each passing day, he grew stronger gradually bidding farewell to his limp until he could walk gracefully, as if the shooting incident had never occurred. Talk about a fortunate turn of events. You see, dear viewers, deer meat is considered a delicacy, attracting hunters far and wide. Their impressive antlers are also highly coveted and often sold as valuable commodities. Ella, being no stranger to the taste of venison, faced a moral dilemma. She couldn't bear to witness this gentle creature suffer such a slow and painful fate. Her empathy won over her own desires, and she took it upon herself to nurse the deer back to health. Her intervention prevented the hunter from finding the wounded animal and ending its life mercilessly for its meat and antlers. Ella's compassionate act saved a life and created an extraordinary bond between them. Years passed, and that once small and wounded deer grew into a magnificent, powerful stag. Yet the animal never forgot the woman who had come to its rescue. Time and again he would return to Ella's house, even during harsh winter days, gently tapping his mighty antlers on her window to grab her attention. Ella would bring him bread and spend cherished moments by his side, like an unspoken ritual between them. Now, you might be wondering what Ella has to say about her extraordinary relationship with this majestic creature. Well, at 81 years old, she expresses her joy and gratitude, saying, When he comes to the window, he stands there, 
waiting for me. I can see him trying to peek through the curtains before I open them. He's just waiting outside for me to come and give him bread or something. It's a beautiful animal with big antlers, a hunter's dream trophy. But luckily, no hunters are trying to get him anymore. He visits more often in winter, traveling far into the mountains during summer and spring. But every time he comes by, it fills my heart with happiness. And there you have it, my dear viewers, a story of resilience, kindness, and the remarkable bond between a compassionate woman and a majestic stag. Let this heartwarming tale serve as a reminder that our actions, no matter how small, can make a world of difference. So stay tuned for more incredible stories like this on our channel. Remember, kindness always has a ripple effect. Until next time, keep spreading love and positivity.